Welcome to 13 Hammer Time 62's Lego Set Reviews. And hit it! That's right, we've got Lego Batman here. Um, this is a 2008 set from around the time the first Dark Knight movie was premiered. None of the Lego sets um, were based on the movie. Um, it was loosely based on Tumblr in the movie, though, and the Bat Cycle. But this one we have today is Robin's Scuba Jet, Attack of the Penguin. It's a $20 value and 207 pieces, so that's very good for what you're, for what you're buying. Now let's get down to work and, um, and take a look at this set hole. So let's start off with Robin Scuba Jet, for which the set is named. This is actually one of the few Robin vehicles that are made by Lego. Um, it's maybe one other one when Batman was first made into the feet. No moving features, but very nice um, shape and style. These parts here are supposed to be missiles, though. You can open up the cockpit, and here we have Robin. Inside of here is supposed to be where the rest of his cape goes, that's why I have it flowing up. But when, when he's not inside of there, he can keep the cape down. And there's no second head. I know some, some modern Batman sets have, um, for Robin and for most characters, they have a second side to their head, not this one. This is different than the first Robin that was released because of his hairpiece. The first one did not have the same one as you see here. And I'm trying to fit him back into the, into the scuba jet. Now we'll go to the Penguin Submarine. This is an updated version of the Penguin Submarine that was yet again released the first time um, when Batman became a theme. Looking at, looking at it from here, it definitely looks like a submarine to me. I mean, maybe not with this on it because this is a... Oh, that part is the Penguin's umbrella, which I just like to keep on top while the penguin sits in the submarine. This little piece um, sits on the top here. So then in case anybody was standing on top of the submarine, wanted to stand over it, they can use this part so they're not stuck in between. We do have a periscope. And what I like about it, if you can see right underneath this missile, you can see the periscope is attached on the other side and moving around. When we get to the inside of the ship, it'll look cooler. Of course, you have the penguin's umbrella. And let's see if we can get him out. We'll take a look on the outside first. Um, spinning propellers, little flippers. This piece is cool. I'm not gonna try to shoot you with it, but when you lift up this lever, at a certain point, it'll shoot out the missile. Very cool for a submarine. Now this front, there's also um, two flick missiles, forgot to mention, on here as well. Now, um, on the, on this part in the front, this is hollow. And you can take it off, take it apart maybe. And this is where I, this is where I like to store the penguin henchmen. There's two of them included in this set, one with a harpoon and one with a gun. Your standard penguin henchman. It is a little bit hard to get off at first, but it's doable. Now this part comes up, and inside we have we have the penguin at the controls. 
with his radar. Let me take him out. And let me show him. Most people will recognize this set from the Lego Batman game, which was released around the time of these sets. And um, these and these two parts of the set, the scuba jet and the submarine, are included in the game as playable vehicles. I really like the set. I remember I tried to time how long it took to build it, just for fun. And it took me 20 minutes. It's very simple to build, and it's very stable. You can see on the inside here, that's how you can take off and put on the, the top piece. There's a couple of stickers that are involved with building it. Now we can take the penguin and sit him on the top here, looking out in Gotham City. So, and for some reason, on on most of the Batman sets at 2008, there is this Batman sticker in the instructions with looks like scratch marks. I guess that's either the, either to mean that Batman Batman's either conquered these villains, or um. Or it means that they are from the Batman theme.